everyone, this is Ethan, and this is a MotionTutor.com video lesson. This lesson will be on comparing things that are taller and shorter, and also longer, shorter, and if they're the same height. Okay, we'll start with these objects over here on the right. We have a box of juice, and we have a ketchup bottle. Now, looking at this, we can see that the box of juice is taller than the ketchup bottle. So, you can say this box of juice is taller than the ketchup bottle. You can also say the ketchup bottle is shorter than the box of juice. So this ketchup bottle is shorter than this box of juice. Over here, with these two objects in the middle, we have a toy ambulance and we have a stuffed animal. If we look carefully, we can see they are the same height. So this toy ambulance and this stuffed animal, they are the same. Neither one is taller or shorter than the other. Over here, we have a plant and we have this rock. And just clearly looking at this, we can see that the plant is shorter than the rock. Or in other words, the rock is taller than the plant. All right, let's look at my board, and we'll see some more examples. Okay, looking at this example, we have this little mushroom house in the middle, and some trees are beside it. Now, I have some questions to ask you. Looking at this picture, how many trees are the same height as this mushroom house? Looking carefully, how many trees are the same exact height? Well, if you look carefully, this tree looks like it's the same height as the top of this mushroom house, and that tree looks like the same height. So, two trees are the same height as this mushroom house. How many trees are shorter than the mushroom house? Well, just looking at this, we can see that there are three trees shorter than the mushroom house. And there they are. And how many trees are taller than the mushroom house? And in this picture, we see one tree, which is way taller than this mushroom house. And it's over here, right there. Let's look at some more examples. With this one, looking at this picture, we have a cat and we have some boxes stacked on top of each other. Well, they're actually squared shapes, but we just call them boxes for now. How many boxes tall is this cat? Just by looking at this picture, how many boxes are stacked on top of each other to equal the same height of this cat? Well, when we look at this, we see one, two, three. So this cat is three boxes tall. What about this girl? How many boxes tall is this girl? Let's count the boxes. One, two, three, four, five. This girl is five boxes tall. Now check this one out. How many boxes tall is this soda can? 
Now, these boxes are stacked up. There are five boxes stacked high. But exactly how tall is this can, though? If we look carefully, we see that it's one, two. It's just two boxes high, or two boxes tall. Although we see five boxes lined up here, it's just two boxes tall, or two boxes high. All right, so how many boxes long is this fork? Let's count the boxes. One, two, three, four, five. So this fork is five boxes long. And what about this pencil? How many boxes long is this pencil? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This pencil is seven boxes long. Now take a look at this. It's the same pencil, and I have more boxes out here. But exactly how many boxes long is this pencil? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's still seven boxes long, although there's still extra boxes laying here. It's still seven boxes long. I just did that just to show you something. And that's all for now. Be sure to visit motiontutor.com for more video lessons and subscribe to us for more updates and lessons. Goodbye.